Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel, it's Island Gamer here, back with another episode of FIFA 21 Career Mode and it's on the World Class Difficulty setting. And as you can see we start off today with a tough game against Arsenal in the Premier League. Um, but before we get into any of that, um, I just want to remind you that to make sure um, you don't miss any future content coming to this channel, the best thing for you to do is to hit that subscribe button and... Um, hit the little bell as well so you get the notification whenever new videos go live to the channel um, if you have missed any of the previous um, content um, there is always a link in the description box below that will take you to a playlist um, if you're enjoying these videos I'd love it if you could give it a thumbs up for me a like and um, I'd really appreciate that and it lets me know that you are enjoying the videos and lastly I'd love to hear your feedback so anything you want to say to me go ahead leave me a comment and I'll always get back in touch with you so you've probably been able to see this flashing back and forward uh, so you can see just how tight it is at the top of the league here um, is uh, we've all played 17 games at the top there and you can see the top three are all on 44 points and Arsenal who we're playing are on 36 and Spurs not that far behind Arsenal either so this is the season um, this is the calendar so you can see um, it's been a very hectic and busy month in a December for us, but we've been able to get through it and because um, we've got a decent squad um, We've been able to u utilize the team to make sure that we're not over sort of um, Using players and risking injuries and stuff like that um, And as you can see it's gone quite well this month so far. We've played for one for um, Just a wee bit disappointed we concede more goals than I would like us to concede, but we're also scoring plenty as well um, so we've still got one, two, three, four, we've got five games to play now because we are through to the next round of the uh, Carroll Cup. I'm not sure what team that's against, but um, we'll come up against them at some point. So stay, um, that won't be in this video, sorry, but um, make sure you don't uh, miss that uh, Cup game by hitting that subscribe button. So we are playing Arsenal next and it is game day. And I've already picked the squad, so you can see that obviously Van der Beek is in for the injured Pogba. Um, but apart from that, it's kind of as it has been for most of the season. Um, the subs as well. Um, Haaland is in, in just now. Uh, Martial has been on great form. Um, again, if you haven't been uh, watching this season, go ahead, watch back and you'll see Martial has been keeping Mbappe and Haaland on the bench because of his fantastic form. So guys, uh, let's go ahead and get into this game.
well guys it was a 2-0 win but to be honest it should have been a lot more than that um some of that finishing um was shocking uh sancho had an amazing chance fernandez had an amazing chance and Haaland had an amazing chance all all squandered so that could have been an extra three goals um but the most important thing for me was apart from the win of course is we defended better and we got the uh, clean sheet um so that's really happy and uh w w worth that and uh, i need to sort of try and do that more often okay so i just got this message through guys so i've got a risk of losing five players so what i'll do just now is i'll um go and try and get them all tied down onto better contracts okay guys so that's um everyone signed down to longer term contracts now um uh apart the only one that i could only get onto the one year was two and zero so that will need to be looked at again next year but um rashford is now with us for another four years so he's got four years seven months on his contract and luke shaw has three years seven months on his contract so quite good contracts there uh, for the two main guys there um and uh yeah it gives me a bit of negotiating especially with shaw if i do decide to um increase um my strength at left back like i was talking about in a previous episode uh but anyway that's uh transfers well not transfers that's contracts sorted out for the time being and we're going to have a look at the squad for the rest of the game As you can see that the squad is looking good i'm going to put Haaland back in um apart from that i think everyone is going to stay the same in fact they're not i'm going to go and put diaby back in and see how he gets on um because sure um sancho's been missing chances again but apart from that we're going to keep everything as it is and leicester in ninth i'm top uh so a tricky game here but let's just get into it
Well, that was uh, quite a game of football. Um, I'm not going to say I was uh, disappointed with the way we defended because um, they were a good team and they gave us some issues. Um, but uh, Schmeichel was good for them and uh, caused us uh, uh, a stressful end to the game because, uh, yeah, it took a late, late goal by Mbappe. And, uh, yeah, another late goal in the previous game. So, um, yeah, team's keeping us on our toes at the minute. Uh, let's see how bad this injury is, though. To the inbox, player injured. Okay, so he's suffered a broken elbow. He's going to be out for two months. It's not as bad as I thought. Um, okay, I'll just delete that, and I can delete that. That was the one with people running out of contracts. Um... This is what's happened with the league now. So you can see top three are all on 50 points. Spurs are on 40 points, uh, 10 points behind. I don't know if that's maybe a wee bit too far now, but it's, um, yeah, it's so tight, isn't it? Um, surely one of us has to blink soon, but hopefully it's not me. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to try Haaland and Mbappe up top. And that's the only change I'm going to make. I would love to make more changes, I really would. Um, but with this league being so tight, I, 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 I don't feel like I want to risk it just now. Um, so I'm just going to have to put my strongest 11 out, I think. And if someone needs change because they're getting a bit tired, then I'll change them. But apart from that, I think they'll be playing just now um let's get into this game oh i've got to fix that injury don't i there we go that's better okay now we can play the game
Well, guys, um, we've not been convincing today. Uh, we've we've uh, had to score three late goals in all three games, um, but at the end of the day, we've got the we've we, we've won every game. Um, and let's have a look at what that does to the table. So we're twenty games in now, so we're deep into um, the table now, and there's still three teams on 53 points man united man city liverpool 53 points. now just imagine if that was real life you know that that what a season that would be um and we're not even pulling away that much of a goal difference because our goals against is pretty poor um compared uh, and, and the goals for we're not scoring i don't think as many as we maybe would normally but um what an exciting season this is um if you've not subscribed you know do it now <laughs> it's such a good season um i'm a little surprised here and uh, marshall saying he needs more games he's been getting quite a lot um yeah um oh you're still in the squad we'll do that um yeah it's a little surprising that and oh and mbappe as well when you've got um Mbappe and Haaland as who's meant to be your two main strikers but you've also got Martial who's playing so well it's difficult to keep all three of them uh, happy but it's a it's it's a problem that I'm happy to have so here we go guys so we have made it relatively unscathed um in terms of injuries at least to the towards the end of the month now um you can see there that's one two three four five six games played this month if i'm reading that right one two three four five yes yeah, seven games played this month sorry um and we've won all seven that's really good um even if we have considered more goals than we wanted to and now we've just got the two um two more games to play so next time out it'll be newcastle and then there's a cup game i'm sorry i'm not sure who that is i don't want to sort of guess um and then after that we've got arsenal away in the cup again um so again um an interesting and quite exciting um set of fixtures next time out with arsenal at the end there um yes you, you would have seen um today was it yeah today um sort of how close they ran me so um if you don't want to miss those episodes you want to do go ahead hit that subscribe button um and hit the bell as well so you get that notification when the episode goes live on youtube um and if you're enjoying it please give me a like i would love to sort of um see people liking it lets me know that they are enjoying the videos and lastly leave me comments speak to me let me know what you're thinking what i can do to improve things uh for the videos let me know what you'd like me to try for transfers for formations anything you want to say to me go ahead say it um and i'll get back in touch with you um but thank you so much for watching guys but that is it for now um, whoever you are and wherever you are, happy gaming and have a good day.